Welcome back. This is week 35, update version 0.47. Well, we have two cool new things for you this week, as usual. This week's stage that was used at the Area 1 2017 Championships called Bridge the Gap. This was stage 2, where the user had to walk along the planks and shoot, which is pretty fun. I've also made some improvements to the game from a tutorial standpoint display here to show how users how they get access to the menu because that's the number one request or concern by new players so you hold down the menu button bring up the menu and then hide it simple things like that and then the other one i'll show you in game so let's go all right so this is bridge the gap this was uh, a stage stage two at the 2017 area one championships in saint george utah so for those for those of you who gone to that range, you will notice the um, looks very similar, very dusty. There's uh, hills in the back end, at the back of the range, huge berm, right? It's pretty fun. So the way to shoot these stage is you stand on either axis, either this X or that one over that side, and then you engage um, all the targets as visible while being on the plank. Uh, so you can walk off the plank and get on, but you can only shoot while you're on the plank. So the shooting area is effectively the red marker. So the way to do it is you start here, and then you pro you move forward a little bit to about this position. Um, the reason why you go to this position, you want to get those three, and this one over here. And then, so that's position one. I'm just going to put a waypoint. Next position was here in the middle, where you can see the three. And... And that target over there. And the fourth position was over here, I believe, to get this um, tuxedo target, those two. And then there's one hidden target over there where you have to take two steps up to get this one. And most of us shot this one this way. There's a bunch of videos online in YouTube. If you search for 2017 USPSA Area 1 Championships, you'll find a bunch of videos, myself included, uh, that I posted uh, stage videos for this stage. Pretty fun. Let's go take a look. So the other thing I wanted to talk about too is before I start a game was I implemented a simple tutorial assistant feature where most new players wouldn't know how to start the game. They can see they can access the menu but they have no idea how to start the game. So so what I did for them was made an option available in the menu where you can toggle the tutorial, which is the one at the bottom here. So if you the moment you toggle the tutorial you see that uh, controls appear right next to your hand uh, and it show you what are your options. So we can reload with this with this uh, button here, teleport and move with this button on the left hand. So if I start the stage. Make ready. Okay, so you can draw a gun from the belt using the grip button. So you make ready, assume the start position. Are you ready? Mm-hmm. Stand by. And when you draw the gun, you see now you can hold to move to the next waypoint, which is what I'm going to do right now. Move to the next waypoint and then engage the targets. Bring it up, move to the next waypoint. Even when you reload, it shows you uh, on this side, hold the grab magazine and reload. This position. And then move forward. And that's nice position. Ah, I shot out of, out of uh, I stepped forward too much. So there you go, that's the stage. So even uh, the tutorial is handy because then it shows you what to do when you unload again. So if you end the stage. If you are finished, unload and show clear. So unload, press the menu button. If clear, hammer down and holster. Hammer down, pull the trigger, and then holster. Pull holster gun at belt. Range is clear. There you go. Yeah, and the mic there. I think I hit the, hit the wall here, as you can see. So yeah, apart from that, pretty cool stage. I like this stage a lot because um, it was one of the more interesting stages at the uh, Area 1 Championships. And um, yeah, so and a simple tutorial feature here. Hopefully this will guide users to be able to be able to start the game and, and, and end the game, which was the biggest problem for new users playing the game. Uh, I'm still working on the full tutorial. Hopefully I can get that done, but uh, this was one of the first things I thought about. Let's head back to the main menu. Okay. The tutorial appears in the main menu. You can it's enabled by default. If you don't want it, if you know how to play the game already, you can just shoot it in the advanced menu and turn it off and you will remain off 
until you turn it back on again. And it, and this tutorial is available in the practice range as well, and uh, and all the stages. So yeah, there you go. So I hope you guys like it. This is a simple update, uh, and please give me some feedback on this tutorial mode. I made some fixes to even the lighting conditions here in the main menu. As you can see, you got the the lighting is a little bit more realistic now, got a little bit darker because you're in the shade, and some of the shadows are way nicer now. And looking forward to bringing something else new for you guys next week. See ya.